To throw once more on second and 10. Prescott, he'll fire deep downfield for Lamb. And that will be incomplete. Try to dial up the long way way out there, but it'll be third down. So, C.D., you talk about this football team, and some of the whispers and reports, the social media posts, they hint at a locker room that's splintered, badly splintered. There was talk earlier, some guys might walk away entirely, but that hasn't happened, however, at least to this point. No, and sometimes some of that talk is just that. Talk. I mean, guys often say, that's it, I'm out of here, and then they realize, I'm not ready to retire yet. What am I going to do now? And they're really ready to come back and die. And he's going to lose a yard or two. Taken down behind the line. Back at the two now. Here's second and goal. To throw is Prescott. And that is caught. Touchdown, Cowboys. Kyle Pitts with touchdown number eight on the year. And the Cowboys are an extra point away from tying the football game. You get down near the goal line, this is where having a sure-handed tight end becomes a luxury, and it pays off big time, especially when the defense sells out against the run. He finds himself open for an easy touchdown. So with the missed PAT in his rearview mirror, he goes back out to kick this one off. Pulls it in at the 13. And they're going to start this drive in pretty good shape as they get it up past the 30. So here are the Bills to take over. They've won two straight, and they lead this one as well as they come up on first and ten. Not much room to run. Just gets it to the 35 after showcasing his tough running. Call it a gain of four on first, and that'll make it second down. Working out of the shotgun, here's Allen. That's caught by Gabriel Davis. And able to get this one across the 45 before he's brought down. Allen now on first down. His throw incomplete. From the snap, he certainly looked like he knew where he wanted to go with the ball, but surprise, that guy was covered. So that took his attention elsewhere to no avail. On second down, Mayo. And he is going to be stopped cold behind the line of scrimmage. Two yards the loss, and now third and 12. Gun, it's Allen. He's going to flip one out here to his running back. And they'll bring him down right at midfield, and he is well short of the first down. He did his best to just get four out of that, but not enough. And now fourth down. We can make this one pretty simple. Locked up all of his progressions downfield, forced to get it to his running back. But how about the way they ran to the football and knocked him down to force a fourth down? That is how you flip field position. That's an absolute bomb of a punt. Downs it inside the five-yard line, absolutely ideal. From that position, you're hoping to get it down inside the 15, inside the five, superb. Meanwhile, Dax throw there, caught by Gallup. A big play here for Dallas. So the line of scrimmage all the way up to midfield now as they've got it first and 10. Eluding the pressure right. It's caught, Cooper. And he is brought down, but not before reaching the 30. So first and 10 now from the 30. Prescott now on the move to his left. They'll set up the screen to Elliott. And inside the 20 before he's brought down. So here's a first and 10 now down inside the 20. From the red zone now, Prescott. And he's got it. Touchdown, Cowboys. Two first half touchdown passes now for Dak Prescott. And the Cowboys have retaken the lead. Tucker with the extra point, and that'll make this a six-point game. Just a four-play drive that time, and it culminates in a Dallas touchdown. Tucker now to kick it away following the touchdown. 
Pulls it in at the 13. And they're going to start this drive in pretty good shape up past the 30. The Bills come to the line to start their next drive. And it's only November, but the playoffs, we know how it works. They'll be here before you know it. If it ended today, they would be the number one seed. And that's a great spot to be in, but I love the phrase, if it ended today. And I'll guarantee you, that's what they've discussed in their locker room, in their meeting rooms. Yeah, we know where we'd be if it ended today, but we also know it's not ending today. Right. So they've got to continue to play the type of ball that put them in the spot where they're number one in their conference. Good strong throw and catch right there. And so far in this game, the alleys have been open for them to get completions, and they're taking advantage of it. They'll run on first down. Mayo. Give him five on the carry there, and it'll be second down. From the gun, he'll hand this off. And some good tackling there as he stopped up at about the 41. So third and two, this quite possibly four down territory though if they're stopped. And they'll run on the inside handoff. And he's gonna be taken down here still a couple yards short of the first. He needed two, he got one, and that's gonna leave him with fourth down at a yard. And that is no good. Oh, he missed it just wide of the upright. And this score will stay right where it is. Well, this winds up an empty possession. Everything looked OK. He just never got the ball on target. And knowing him, he'll be disappointed with that effort. About set for this next drive by the Cowboys offense. And he'll take it across midfield and into Buffalo territory. After the pickup of five, here's second and five. Elliott, toss right. And he'll be close to a first down as the tackle made at the Bills 44. The offense on third down tonight, they've been near perfect. Four for five to this point. They're looking at third in the nose of the football. And that one going nowhere from the start as he's met in the backfield and goes backwards. And now White. Not sure exactly what happened, but he's still down. This offense converted once on fourth down earlier. Now they're out there again to try once more. And the training staff works on him. He'll step aside and be right back. The fourth down run successful. Now they look to pay it off on first down. They keep on the ground with Elliott. Nice little juke, and he'll be out of bounds as he gets this down about the 21 or 22. 54 yards rushing for him now on what was his 10th carry of the ball game. All runs on this drive so far. It's first and 10. They'll try to sweep with Elliott. Two yards on the carry there. It'll be second down. Now a running play here with Lamb. The second wave of tacklers is going to get him as they stop him behind the line. Now a stoppage here as we've got a bill shaken up on the play. The Cowboys on third down. They've converted four times out of six. Not bad. This is third and nine. While the trainers take a look, we'll step aside. Flushed out right. And that is incomplete. Early on, the running game's been working well, and the offensive line has been pleased by that. The thought process there, catch those safeties creeping up, trying to help against the running game. They tried to hit them over the top, unsuccessfully. And this is intercepted, but they'll say out of bounds. So very close to a turnover there in the end zone. Allen and the Bills now with a first and 10 at their own 22. He's going to throw this one down to Fort Worth. He'd rather have the incompletion than the turnover. Back to the air on second down. It's Allen. That's caught by his tight end, Dawson Knox. And they're going to get this beyond the 40 before he's taken down. You don't always expect tight ends to be big in terms of run after the catch, but after that play, he joins a growing band of players that's putting that stereotype right on its ear. Allen's throw is complete. Three yards the game there, second down. Now Allen. 
Allen. Allen hit. He lost the football. It's picked up by the Cowboys. And they will finally put it into the return, but not until he takes it back all the way inside the 10-yard line. The defense gets him the ball via the turnover. Now can this offense cash in? First and goal. The quick slant caught. And we've hit the two-minute mark in this first half of action. They'll try to run it in with Allen. And he'll take it into the end zone for a Cowboy touchdown. Ezekiel Elliott, his 11th touchdown of the year. And the Cowboys are able to strike quickly to add on to their lead. Tucker able to connect on the extra point, and the lead now stands at 13. They had the short field, and they made quick work of it. Just two plays to get into the end zone. Tucker now to kick it away following the touchdown. Pulls it in at the 13. And they're going to start this drive in pretty good shape as they get it up past the 30. The Bills come to the line to start their next drive. And last time, not only the turnover, but that turned into six points. They got to make up for that here. You always hear about empty possessions, but some are worse than others. So you can have an empty possession, pump the ball away, get yourself set to play defense, but when you turn it over, it changes momentum, and when they take it downfield and punch it in on you, that's a bad possession all the way around. Yeah, but you're hungry to get back out there, aren't you? You better be, because otherwise, it's going to be a long day for you. Back-to-back -back good plays have them on the move on first down. Meanwhile, Allen's throw here, take it in by Knox. And after that completion, you can understand why so many teams in the league are emphasizing speed on defense at every position. The tight ends have created so many tough matchups now. If you can't run with a tight end as a linebacker, this is going to be the result every time. An incomplete pass on second down leads us to third and inches. Now Allen. And this pass broken up. But the contact well timed there. And now fourth down. Gonzalez's kick is good. And that gets him back within 10. So he missed his first attempt, remember, but this time he gets back on the bike and knocks it home. Yeah, and sometimes that first one can really impact you moving forward. It can just stay with you too long and affect everything else you do during the game. In this case, though, able to shake it off. He's riding high again. And they'll start this drive just across the 30. Pretty nice work on the return. The Dallas offense here set to begin the drive. And with a little under a minute to go, still time to try to put a drive together to add to their lead, should they so choose. On the run, he'll let it go deep, right sideline. And it's incomplete. Took a shot, couldn't connect. I know he was trying to get the completion downfield, but the way this game has gone, with a few of the runs he's made along the way, he should have kept the ball and taken it with his feet downfield. That's the big play that shreds the defense. Instead, he thought to himself, I'm a quarterback. I've got to throw it. He bailed out the defense with that incompletion. And this is, oh my goodness, he pulled it in one-handed. A real field flipper there as all of a sudden they've got a first down in the red zone. This throw caught right around the six. Now a timeout taken. Perhaps a chance for one more quick play and then another timeout if they hurry. We'll see. A chance to really cap off a big first half here as they come up on first and goal. They'll throw again. Prescott. And that will be incomplete. Four ticks left here on the clock. So with four seconds to go in the half, here's the field goal unit onto the field. This is an easy one. 23-yarder. Tucker's kick is good. 